So one of the things we did at Google was we took a ton of power away from managers. They weren't allowed to decide who to hire, who to promote, how to set compensation. All these decisions were either made by other people, by committees, or with the manager's input, but somebody else's oversight and final decision making. The reason we did that was the manager-employee dynamic is really political and vicious. Because as a manager, you want your people to do well, you care about them, but you want them to perform. And as an individual, you want to make your manager happy because you know your whole career hangs on them. The way you break that apart is by taking power away from managers. Because once managers aren't in a position to make every single decision about my life, my manager's job just becomes, how do I make Laszlo more effective? What does he need? What kind of coaching? What kind of support? Does he need more resource? Does he need some advice? And so the beautiful thing is when you take away all these carrots and sticks that managers usually have, the only thing they're left able to do is help their people.